Uh, Joe and his partner Marty Maltz took him to court on behalf of the NAR and Tripoli for nine years, and it's the only time ATF has lost a case in court. So Joe was a brilliant lawyer. He was an MIT nuclear engineer, and so the rocket is painted in the colors of MIT. In fact, Joe and I went to MIT at the same time, but I flew rockets and he was busy studying. So, <laughs> So anyway, in honor of Joe Egan, we put this rocket together and we're going to fly it today. We also flew it at TARC a couple of weeks ago. It's flying with a little more power today. But today, let's honor our friend Joe Egan, an MIT nuclear engineer, a lawyer, a rocketeer with this flight. It's a very big rocket. It's an 11.4 inch rocket with a K535 in it. And we want to thank Joe Egan for all that he did for us. So I'll turn it over to the LCO to do the countdown. It's out on pad C2, the leftmost pad on the C-Bank, the big gray and red rocket. All right. Well, I guess I get to push the button then. Out on pad Charlie 2, the Joe Egan rocket. Five, four, three, two, one, start. Thank you, Joe Egan. Here, if you can put this back, every memory card I have is full. Imagine that. Well, to be fair, he didn't check for your laptop. Was that yours? 